If you have ever wondered, is there any difference between using a hard disk drive and a solid state drive when it comes to loading libraries into contact? This video will answer that question. We're going to directly compare loading libraries into contact using a hard disk drive first and then those same libraries using a solid state disk drive. So let's go ahead and check it out. We'll start easy with damage and the hard drive. So that was about seven seconds for the hard drive. Now the SSD. And it's much faster at only three seconds. Back to the hard drive and the grandeur. It looks like it's loaded, but it's not. Pay attention to the progress bar. Once all the samples are loaded, the third block will be white. And that was about 23 seconds. Now the SSD and the grandeur. See how it loads the samples much faster? And that was only about five seconds versus 23 for the hard drive. So instead of making you wait for real time, we'll speed through the rest of these. And finally, the Orchestra Complete 2 and the hard drive. We'll load a big multi. The timer doesn't start until I hit yes. There's three instruments and over two gigs to load, so we'll go ahead and speed this up. And it's done. That was about one minute and 35 seconds. Now the SSD and the same multi in real time. And it's done. That was only about 25 seconds instead of one minute and 35 seconds for the hard drive. Here's a detailed breakdown between the hard drive, the SSD, and how much faster the SSD is. As you can see, the SSD is not just faster, it's significantly faster. And even though an SSD large enough for the entire complete collector's edition is about two to four times more expensive than a hard disk drive, 
it's definitely a recommended upgrade because of the faster load times and better performance in native instruments. Contact.